evening, Mr. and Mrs. America. Movie Bone News presents The Babe Calls His Shop. We take you to beautiful Wiggly Field for Game 3 of the World Series. 1-0 is the count against the Champa. Roof fans the ballpark with strike two. Even old Glory is cheering him on. The powerhouse pug points to where he'll put the pill. There's a long drive, way back. This one is out of here, folks. Another four back up for our four-legged friend. Has big smiles for the proud papa, Coach Wilson, and his wonder of an underdog. This has been a movie bone presentation. Hi everyone, it's Mitch from SportsChatPlace.com. Wednesday, July 17th, 2013. Here with your free dog of the day pick. Of course, over on Twitter, tweet now Mitch's Twit Pick under my handle at SportsChatPlace under the hashtag Mitch's Twit Pick. And you can see those right on the screen. And uh, an exclusive pick each and every day. And of course, uh, on my podcast, the first quarter, I'm tweeting out at least four exclusive free picks each and every day. And uh, I'm still doing that even through the Major League Baseball all-star break uh still giving out at least four picks we're also running through the nfl teams looking at the total wins we're on the green bay packers today and uh we carry on in the nf uh three down in the nfc north as we uh continue to move through every nfl team looking at their win total as set by the las vegas hilton sportsbook a little breakdown of the team their off-season moves and uh making a pick if they're going to go over or under that win total normally i talk about the premium area here but really no premium picks until friday so uh We'll save that for another day, but with football coming right around the corner, hey, no one had a better college football record than I did. Two of the last three seasons I did it, and uh, winning record, of course, in the NFL as well. And uh, hey, that takes us right to our dog of the day pick. You know what? I got three dogs today. It's the British Open. It's a huge field. It's golf picking one guy. I found three golfers out of there that I think getting better than 50 to 1 prices on. These guys are all worth the shot. My, my smallest dog of the bunch, Ian Poulter, 50 and a half to 1. Uh, gotta like the way Poulter hits the ball. This guy certainly has what it takes to win a major. Then we have a guy that's won a major before, Zach Johnson. Of course, he's got a green jacket uh, to his credit. 60 and a half to 1. And then there's a guy that only shows up for majors Angel Cabrera, Angel Cabrera, however you want to say it, I'll say 105 to 1. I like those guys. Hey, boys, you're my dogs of the day. This is Mitch. Thanks for joining me. Have a great day. I'll be back tomorrow.